This is subtraction smash. I'm going to start with five. So I'm going to put five of these back in the container or just cover them up for now. Let's see. There's five. Just scoot them that way. Never mind the container. And we'll start with these five. So I have one, two, three, four, five. I'm going to write the number five here, because that's how many I'm starting with, and a subtraction sign. When I subtract, I pull the number apart. So I'm actually gonna smash some of these and see how many I have left. Let's see, I'd like to start by taking away three. One, two, three. So I took away three. How many do I have left? One, two. So five minus three equals two. Now I'm going to roll these back up again. And try starting with five a different time. Okay, this time I'm gonna start with five, and I'm going to take away four, because smashing them is pretty fun. One, two, three, four. Oh, I have one left. Five minus four equals one. I'm gonna roll these back up. I'm gonna do one more with five. Sorry, I'm outside. So we'll get to hear a little bit of noise from outside my house. Okay, one, two, three, four, five. This time, I'm gonna do five minus five. Let's see, what does that equal? One, two, three, four, Five. I smashed them all. There are none left. Zero means none. Now I'm going to do some bigger numbers. I'm going to take all of my blue Play-Doh spheres here. Rolling them back up a second. See how many there are. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, so this time I'm starting with ten. Let's take away two. One, two. How many are what does 10 minus 2 equal? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 10 minus 2 equals 8. You can really do this with any number. You just change the number of blue or whatever color, Play-Doh spheres that you start with so that you can tell which ones are smashed and flat and which ones are not. So I'm gonna put this back and this back. So we're back to 10. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And let's take away six. Ten. Minus six. Let's see how many that equals. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, look, these are the ones I have left. Ten minus six equals one, two, three, four. All right, I'm going to get ready to do one more. If you choose to do this work, you can do as many as you want. 
And I would like you to do it at least five times, just so you get the habit of trying it out and seeing how it works. So we're gonna start with 10 again. And I think we will take away seven this time. I like doing the smashing. I got some new Play-Doh, so it's nice and smushy feeling. All right, so I'm starting with 10. And now I'm going to take away seven. I'm gonna split that 10 into seven and whatever's left, let's see. One, two, three, oops, four, five, six, seven. Oh, these are left. One, two, three. Ten minus seven equals three. 